because right now, I mean, they're the way they headed out, you know, every one of them heading out of those trailers moving good, and they were heading right where we wanted them to go. We wanted them right up in those hills right there, because um, that's like dead center of all the best habitat in this Tendoy Lima Peaks country. You know, when you're capturing animals, there's this level of stress that's just always there, you know, because you're doing something that is potentially dangerous for those animals. And so, you know, in the moment, you're seeing all kinds of things. You're like, is that okay? Is that okay? But then looking back on it, you know, it went incredibly smoothly. It was just pretty much without a hitch. So, pretty thankful for that. A lot of moving parts, just, just to see, you know, 25 sheep run up into the hill here is pretty, uh, pretty emotional, but there's a lot of people behind it. And, you know, for the people that live in this area, um, we were just talking to uh, the game warden there, was talking about being able to see lambs in the spring, you know, down by the creek. That's, that's cool stuff, so. All these ones have GPS collars um, and they're downloadable and so I will begin monitoring their movements today. After you capture there's always a couple weeks where you know there's a potential for capture myopathy um, that you're worried about. Um, the way they were sitting in that trailer and the way they came out and I'm, I'm hopeful we won't have any of that though. So it'll be looking at other things too. I mean, there's mountain lions up there. Uh, chance they could run into one. But this is a good place for them. You know, those hills up there, you know, that's good sheep habitat. You know, there's plenty of grazing up there. And you look at all the fescue and everything, you think, you could certainly picture sheep grazing here, but um, no, you don't have to picture anyone. You can be able to see it. <laughs> 